Suspect vehicle is a black BMW. Oh, I missed my turn. That's okay. I was too busy passing that person to uh, realize. All right. Oh. Well, I can just go this way, I think. <laughs> driving in a zone of Rockport or something. I'll tell you what, the roads aren't as nice as Rockport. Jesus, that was a crater, not a pothole. Jesus Christ. Well, I ain't ever going on this road ever again. <laughs> Stay away from the potholes. Ugh. Jesus Christ, that was atrocious. Well, we escaped St. Louis. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I'll just not miss my turn next time. That was a terrible road. Those, cra those craters were enormous. Craters, potholes. The potholes were craters. Basically. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm just so flabbergasted. Alrighty, now we're into the civilized part of the world. Good old Illinois, the land of Lincoln. I got an email today from Tammy something. I think she's a senator or a house representative. I'm not sure. She's a politician. Um, in response to a message f uh, that I sent through one of the forms on SEMA, basically saying, I don't like what the EPA is doing, basically making it impossible for people to have combustion engine cars and this and that, and her basically going, well, I think electric vehicles are good for the environment, so I'm going to say I'm not going to oppose the EPA and what they're doing, and so I'm like, okay, well, gearheads don't vote for that chick, <laughs> Tammy something, I'll put her name on the screen. There should just be a list of people that if you don't know who to vote for, but you want cars to be fun for as long as possible, there should just be a blacklist of politicians that, you know, are just not cool with internal combustion engines and sports cars and all that. They'd rather sell out to EVs and all that kinds of nonsense. Doesn't that lane end? I'm so confused. Am I gonna see another train, by the way? It's happened every single time I've come through here. Not every single time. Many times. Two times. <laughs> it is pretty disappointing, though. Cars won't be around forever. Eventually, the politicians will win. They'll make fun illegal eventually. They're working at it one step at a time. But, um, yep. Anyways, I guess that just means I'm gonna have to build the cars I wanna build and make a museum or something. If the politicians are gonna win and ruin everything, which they're pretty good at doing. Now, is anybody gonna get pulled over today? That's what I want to know. <laughs> I'm ready for dinner. I'm sure my kids are gonna spaz out when they see me. They're not used to me coming home every day after work. So they, they kind of go a little nuts. I don't know how to really work on that because I appreciate them being excited about me being home, but it also drives their mom nuts. <laughs> well, you guys are no fun. There's the one guy that I thought was a cop, but probably wasn't. But now no one's getting pulled over over here. Man. What do you do for content in the boring part of the country? Where no one drives like a lunatic and no one gets pulled over. I don't know what voice this is. I'm just rolling with it. Rolling, rolling, rolling. What? It's been green for a long time. And it's still green. Huh. 
I like Aldi's. I think I've already talked about that. <laughs> Nothing's happening. There's nothing to engage with. You, old lady behind me, you will burn out. Hit the nitrous. I think you guys will appreciate this. Someone got pulled over back there, and that person over there got pulled over. Well, what do you know? The moment I try and turn off the damn camera, everything just happens. That's a, that's a high-nosed Norfolk Southern engine. You gotta wonder. What were they doing? I, I guess 7.30, 7 o'clock is not a good time to be out here. I don't know. I've gone, gone through here between 5 and 6. I don't know. The next day. Where are you going, Mr. Palisade? Did you stop because there's a white line there or because you saw me coming even though I wasn't really coming oh my god well I guess we're chilling chilling like a villain I'll never do that again I'm sorry wasn't this all blocked off before I could have sworn it was downtown Illinois is that what that said I don't think that's what it said. I like this little bit of an S-curve we got here. The Raptor. The Raptor Velocity, I see what you did there. It's it's just like a Velociraptor. Uh. Uh. There's the arch. That looked like a good Starbucks drink. I wanted to see what it was. I want to engage in capitalism. I want to interact with advertising. But I, I, I'm i not a very fast reader. <laughs> Damn it. I must consume more products. This time I'm not gonna miss my damn turn. I am, however, gonna get frickin' blinded by the sun. I saw an S550 in, in my mirror. Very nice. Can't tell if that's a GT, though. I'd only wanna... It's either the Coyote, the Voodoo, or the Predator. Anything else, I don't really want the S550. I'm kind of on the fence, oh my sweet Jesus, when it comes to the Voodoo. Because I want a supercharged Mustang. Would a supercharged GT350 still be cool? I mean, I suppose the obvious answer is yes, because it's got the Tremec 6 speed, but it's like, green means go, right? Like the scene out of the Paw Patrol movie. Green means go! 